everyone john here at pro age paintball today i've got a quick little tutorial video for you i'm going to show you how to install your hk army or your exalt speed feed for your die rotor so it's pretty straightforward if you have a very old die rotor you're going to need an allen key set um, i believe it's 564 allen key you can double check me on that one um, to take it apart but on the new ltr uh, that we currently sell that's currently available for probably like the last five years you just need a phillips head which is like the plus sign uh, screwdriver so what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and open it up you can go ahead and Push the tab up there, push the button, pull the loader apart, get to go there. And then you're gonna remove these five screws inside of here. So once you've got the five screws removed, go ahead and dump those over. And on the inside of your loader, see just like this, there, you just wanna press the big plastic part in the middle and the top will pop off. Good to go there, okay. One thing I forgot to mention, you will need a pick, like an O-ring pick or whatnot to push this little pin out here. So you want to go ahead and grab your pick and go ahead and press it from the right side to the left side. It doesn't really matter, but you just want to press it. See how you can see the silver pin right there? Um, that is your lid pin that holds the pin, the lid in place. Um, you, what you want to do is you want to press that pin over to where you can't see it anymore. You don't have to press it all the way through. I'll show you a little trick, but you just want to press it where you can't see it anymore. So I'm going to take the pick. Don't stab yourself here. Just push it over. It's just slide over pretty easy. And if you notice here, you can no longer see it there. So then what you're going to do, flip your lid over, take your lid like this. And so this is the side that we pushed over. So that's the side we're going to lift up. You just lift up just like that. See how I notice you can get to it. And then you want to press the pin back the other way. And this might be a little more tough, but there we go. So once you press that over, your lid will kind of just pop out and you don't really want to slide the lid off of the pin because it is a little more difficult to put back together so if you can push it all the way through slowly just like that and keep this pin and spring lid spring on here that helps a lot to keep everything together okay so pretty straightforward there you're going to go ahead and grab your speed feed so we do have both these available on our website proispb.com if you find this video helpful go ahead and hit like Please, and uh, subscribe to our channel if you like videos. And if you want to show your support, uh, feel free to shop our website, proispb.com, and pick up your new speed feeds. Okay, so the way this works here, if you notice, there's little two little grooves cut out in the back right there. That's going to line up with the two grooves cut out here in the back here, where the screw holes are. You want to line that up there and line that one up. And the exalt one should be exactly the same. Just like that so see how it has the two little notches cut out right there at the top you can see it right there at the top um, so it just sets right there so you notice these are almost identical um, the hk army one i believe is 14.95 and the exalt one is 19.95 so depending on which one you like the better color combo but color options both of them have like five to ten color choices you can go and check it out so i did the red and black so it matches our loader okay so once you have everything lined up there you just want to press the top piece back on there Make sure it's smooth all the way around the edges here. Make sure everything's into place and turn it over. And then to finish up, you just need to screw these screws in together and you're ready to go. So that's it, pretty much straightforward. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks guys for watching. See you next time.